There it goes. Hi. Ah. Uh, hi. So, um, I decided that that's that's probably fair, Viv. That's probably fair. Uh, I decided I'm just gonna play No Man's Sky tonight because that's what I want to do. And if we want to talk about stuff, we are absolutely welcome to do that. Whatever y'all want to talk about. Um, but I just really want to play No Man's Sky and just kind of chill out and that's it. That's all I've got. Friday, I still don't know what I'm doing yet. Literally have no idea what I'm doing on Friday. Um, I haven't gotten that far. Um, yeah, like literally it's just question marks down there still. I don't know. I fucking know. Retro Nights this Sunday. Yeah, that's true. Uh, my last stream of the month will be on the 22nd. And that's it. That's it. What do you want to talk about, Viv? You you can talk about anything. There isn't a single Duck Magic the Gathering card, and frankly, that's unacceptable. Why? And he's out of line, but he's right. Why? Magic the Gathering's been a thing for over 20 years. Why is there not a Duck card? What the fuck? All right, let me start the music. Oh, actually, no. I'm not going to start the music because I'm going to start the game in a minute. It's fine. Um, oh, I got the new memory today. Today? Today. It was today. It was this morning because the mail came early. So That was I, so long ago. God, it really was. Like, today was long. Um, but new memory is in the machine and everything, like... I'm noticing everything's performing better because I'm using a ton of memory... I'm using a ton of RAM, um, but also I'm like, everything's just, yeah. Also, Jonas is here. Jonas, hi, buddy. It's good to see you. I've missed you. Oh, because there's a Pokemon duck. There is, there are several Pokemon duck cards. Oh, wait, hold on. I've got and they it. all want sun chips. And they all want sun chips. <laughs> there are six Psyducks outside. Where's my... Where is my side duck? It's it's right here. It's like right here somewhere. Those are my dental picks. Monsters. There it is. Literally always have my side duck right here in case of side duck emergency. Gold duck, side duck, far fetch, ducklet. Yeah. Yeah, um, uh, it gets headaches and flails wildly. <laughs> I mean, honestly, a fucking move. <laughs> Feel that on a spiritual level. That's true. Quaxley, though, true, true, true. Um, yeah, Quaxley's just yeah. Listen, I'm just saying, if the new, if what we've seen so far of Scarlet and Violet, they're actually going to continue in that same pattern, then. It's going to be a good Gen 9. I'm I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. All right, listen. Are you feeling it now, Mr. Krebs? <laughs> right? All right, anyway. Yeah, I'm I'm just and I'm my brain is is already in vacation mode even though I'm not leaving for over a week. And I'm just oof, just so let's just play let's just play the let's play the game. Uh, kinda wish they would have taken longer to announce, but I'm eager for it now that they're here that they have. Uh thoughts on Starfield. Okay, so here that's actually perfect. So here's here's kind of where I am on Starfield. Like I love how expansive the universe is going to be. Um, I am looking forward to seeing how it plays out. However, one of the things that I absolutely love about No Man's Sky is the seamless transition between planet to space to you know, space station or anomaly or whatever. Like, 
the seamless aspect of it. And now that they've said that there's not going to be seamless like planet to space travel, that's it's a little disappointing. I understand that there are a lot of technical considerations behind it. Absolutely. However, No Man's Sky has been doing it for several years. Yeah, there was an there was an interview um, with I think it was with Todd Howard um, where he said that they they said that he said that they they've they thought about it, but like it would be a lot of technical, which is fair, um, and also they figured it was really two different things, right? So one for like being planet side is one specific realm and parrot yes paradigms yes planet side is one paradigm space is another and it's just too too different that people wouldn't really like be into it now, i am i am and i love it but you know y'all know me i'm just i'm here to cause mischief and chaos we all know what the real reason for the loading screens are. So that when you can go into space and the loading screen, you know, fades in and you fade to the loading screen, when you fade back in, you're going to be on that carriage, being a prisoner, being taken away and Skyrim's going to start playing and you know how it works. You think that Starfield's going to be a backdoor to another remake of Skyrim, don't you? Listen, Todd Howard's involved. That's fair. <laughs> I you, rest my fine. case. <laughs> I, I lost it both Jonas and Fifth said it at the exact same time. <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. Oh, that's that's just... Mwah. Well, well done, gentlemen. Well done, both of you. I'm just fantastic. Uh, the drone is doing well. That's all you need to know. Oh, I guess I'm going to tell him. <laughs> Golf clap? <laughs> oh, there you go. See? There you go. The clap works. Excited that we'll be able to visit Mars, though. That's true. And deeply curious to find out how we nuked Earth. Yeah, it's like, wh how did we fuck up Earth this time? Is is Starfield just supposed to be a continuation of Fallout? Is that what, <laughs> what's happening? <laughs> Ooh. Oh, speaking of, speaking of Fallout, Jonas, you know I immediately thought of you. Did you hear what they announced for Fallout 76? They're finally shutting it down? No. No, 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 no. They've announced a new area for Fallout 76. Why? Well, okay, here's what's funny. I'm watching it on the Xbox live stream. Oh, have you? And so I'm watching on the Xbox live stream and like they're showing this off and people are like, wait, what is it? Why does this look like 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 downtown Pittsburgh? And it's literally the pit. Like they have reimagined downtown Pittsburgh as an area in in Fallout 76. Fallout 3, there was a DLC that took you to Pittsburgh and now it's back. Oh, I see, I see. Yeah. So Jonas being, you know, in Pittsburgh, I was like, that's, hmm. that's exactly what I thought about. All right, let's see, what do I have to do now? Make contact with an Atlas Beacon. I don't want to make contact with an Atlas Beacon. Ugh. I feel so bad for anyone that looked at Fallout 76 and, like, thought it was going to be a good game. Like, I, I know there are people that bought it anyway and was, like, they, they kind of knew or it they, they really just wanted a good Fallout game out of it, but, like, the people that s believed it was going to be not a shit show, just, oh, my God, I feel so bad for those people. Well, see, Jonas, that, and that's what I was going to say, like, Jonas 
he still plays it a lot. And I mean, if you're saying it's if you're saying it's still good or it's good now, then you know, like it will No Man's Sky had well, that same problem. No Man's Sky there, was terrible when it got first released. I was say is is it better or is it good? Cuz there's a difference. Cuz No Man's Sky was better for a while. It's it's pretty good now. But it took them a long time to get it that way. Alright, it's time to go home. Really kind of depends on the player, I think. Who are you? Is it Bean? Listen, that strawberry pie that she made, it didn't turn out exactly the way she had hoped, but god damn if it's not delicious. Holy shit, it's good. I had more of it tonight. We made... Guess what we had for dinner, buddy? We had something that you enjoy. Not quite the way you enjoy it, but something that you enjoy nonetheless. Was it a combination of chicken and rice? It was. It was, in fact, chicken, but it was yellow rice. It was saffron rice. Bean, Viv Ooh. says he loves you. Bean? Viv says he loves you. That That's your best friend. My Umbreon was at 69 HP before it used its leftovers. Nice. Uh, it's so Jonas. It is. It is still buggy, but I thoroughly enjoy it. I thoroughly enjoy it. Look, a radiant brain. Let's see. Function as a setting autonomous artificial ply. Wait, what? Oh, so I don't need this? Can I just can I just ditch this? You still in there, buddy? <gasps> you are! Oh, I can get those resources back. Yay. <gasps> I heard a kidarino. It's a loaf. Doing a meow meow? Yeah, she did a meow meow. So the mech is actually called a minotaur. That's actually it's the what buddy, what are you you alright there? Okay. So the mech is that's what the name of the Minotaur or the, the mech is. Oh, Pokemon Go Umbreon. Listen, don't don't start talking about Umbreons. You're gonna you're gonna get Lolly all started. He's he won't know what to do with himself. Fun fact, this Umbreon did originate as a shiny Eevee from Pokemon Go. Oh, there you go. See? So, there you... Yep. Yep. And there you have it. And there you have it. Well, there it is. He's going to eventually lose this fight, but I don't want to yeah. swap out, so it's fine. It's fine. You know what? I wouldn't worry about it. Who's going to know? <clears throat> Hi, Miss Secret. How are you? It's good to see you. But Buddy, are you okay? What happened? Grab him. I heard that scrim. Lolly heard that scrim. <laughs> yeah. Okay. She just she just had a startle. That's all. She's fine. Bean's fine. Oh, I have some there already. Let's just throw those in the old storage container inventory. Uh, Should throw those in the old storage container inventory. Gonna be lurking. Okay, Miss Secret. Well, I I appreciate you. It's good to see you. I hope you're having a good day. Ooh. All right, let's see. Let's see what all I get out of these salvage glass. A Viking effigy. Okay. Oh, okay. A Sentinel boundary map. Viv has the concern. 
That's probably a good call, Viv, honestly. More antimatter. You can throw that in the storage container. You can throw that in the storage container. So yeah, this is my main save. Uh, I'm I'm back on my main save. I finished the expedition, uh, which was fantastic. Loved it. Thought it was just great, great time. Um, loved doing like the roguelite. It was really, really fun. They did a great job with it. Um, so now I'm back to my main save, where I got some decent stuff and. You know, that's great. I love it. All right, let's see what we got here. Uh, what are you? Fire rate plus three percent. That's the ricochet. Okay. Uh, reload time minus two percent. Okay. Okay. Oof, but that kind of fills me up there, doesn't it? Yeah. I don't think reload time minus 2% is that big of a thing. Hi, Karsis. How are you? Good to see you. And let's just throw that in the... I guess I can just put this back in the container. Um... Let's move this up here. How, what, did, what do we get here? Sprint distance plus 33%. Core health plus 33%. Doing some Code Wars tonight. Hanging out. Nice. Nice. Shield strength plus 34. Oh no. Oh, I see. I see. Mm, I'm gonna... I think I'm gonna ditch this one. Let's put this back in the storage container and put this in the cargo area. Yeah. Uh, no, just having fun. Um, I just finished up the, um the expedition the current expedition yesterday i think uh and so now i'm just kind of hanging out and i'm um, gone back to my main save and see what all's there and stuff like that Hmm. That's fine. But yeah, yeah, just kind of having fun for now. Nothing, nothing too far out there. Organizing things, putting some stuff away. Anything in here? I do. Let's just put this in there and go to town. You got some... Yeah, you're good. Um, so yeah, what are you up to? Code Wars? What kind of Code Wars? I remember, I remember playing a game years ago called Core Wars, which was a Code Wars kind of thing. Um, and the idea was, was that you had to write a... You, you could write a very limited assembly program, like an x86 assembly. And um, the goal was like, you and another person would take both of your cores, run them together in a very finite, small memory space. And the goal was to overwrite the other ones, the other persons. That was really fun. Let's throw that in there. Ooh, excuse me. Alright, what do you do? 
warp cell efficiency 100%. I've already got three things that do that, so I'm just gonna get rid of this. Throw that in there. Throw this in the exosuit. Throw this in the storage container. The mining beam. Let's see what we get out of it. We got it. overheat downtime minus 24%. That's nice. I'm for it. Alright, now we got a suspicious Starship Shield module. Uh huh. Ooh, I like that. That's good. That's good. Assembly programming. Good times. Made some friends in that class in college. I. You know, I would. I don't know. I I just feel like I'm not... Assembler scares me. I started building like a very a super like bare-bones operating system uh, a while back. Like it does basically nothing. Um, but yeah, the whole thing just scares me. Like a coding challenge platform like Leak Code, writing functions to do something. Oh, I got you, I got you. Just working on easy problems. Cool. Nice. It's always helpful to, to like, be able to work on that kind of stuff and, you know, stay brushed up and whatnots. Ah, uh, let's see. What do I need to make projectile ammo? Projectiles mostly. Oh, that'll do it. That'll do it. Yeah. Um. Oh, just ferrite dust, and that makes twelve hundred and fifty. Oh well, that's. Yeah, that's. That's easy peasy. That's that's easy money right there. Well, it's not money. I'm not gonna sell it. I I need that. And look, some rusted metal to regain the ferrite that I used, and then some. And some life support gels to put in there. Cool. Well, that's good. Now my... You're stupefied. You stupefied your would-be buddy Travis by reciting the first 20 terms of the Fibonacci sequence. Nice. Hi, Liz. How are you? What you up to tonight? You finished re working on that uh, those tarot cards? That that big set you were working on? Let's see. I'm trying to think. What are my I think they show up in the order in which they're listed. Expand the technology bay of this uh, this here ship. Get this stuff out of my general storage. But boy, this is a this is a, an upgraded ship right here, buddy. My <laughs> warp cell efficiency is through the roof. Like each warp, I think costs five percent. So I could fill this thing up and get twenty warps out of it, which is ridiculously efficient. Base is ridiculously efficient. Hey. Probably. You did finish that. Get out of my sandwich. <laughs> no. Uh, currently eating dinner. A hash brown with sour cream and creamy jalap jalapeno sauce. And three pieces of buttered toast each with an over easy egg and lots of salt and pepper. Oh, God, that sounds so good. Slaps a ship. I can fit so many worms in this, baby. <laughs> can fit so many warps in this bad boy. I love it. I love everything about it. Uh, I do have... Ooh, I like the green. I like that. Wait, why is the item teleportation disabled? Because you right. touch yourself at night. 
Is it because I was inside? Oh, oh, item teleportation is enabled. I was like, I was concerned for a second because it's got like the, the, the digital ghost. But no, it's fine. It's item, item teleportation is enabled. I'm like, why does that not work? But it does. So it's okay. Because the ball is on a string and attached to the cup. Oh my god, am I actually... F I have a full stack of chromatic metal? This is great. Crackle mode is disabled because I just don't feel like wearing the hat tonight. Because it, it gets hot and I'm just... I'm already warm. That's the only reason. Like, it's... It's warm out today. What happens... Hmm... 90 plus here tonight. Oof, yeah, it's it's hot everywhere today. Can I? Ch I don't think I can change this to. No, you got to take it down and put it back up. Uh, that's. That's a little, that's a little blah. This is my storage facility. Where I store things, mostly crap. Read the sentry from the Sentinel Hive Mine. Reach the mark coordinates. Oh! Oh, we got a free Rusty! Here, let me save. Alright, so... So, I'm, I'm, I'm a decent chunk into the main story. And this is Rusty. He's a sentinel, but he's been rewired. His name's Laylapse. He named himself Laylapse, but I'm calling him Rusty. We will be a good team, all of us, and you, and the big Minotaur friend. That's my Minotaur, you see. <laughs> Me to customers every day. I mean, honestly. Uh, the sentry's coordinates. Okay. <laughs> Come on, Rusty. Let's go, buddy. Gotta go. That so you have to take it down and put it back up. Oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> Taking it down and putting it back up is essentially the turning it off and back on again of base building. Yeah. See? Turn it off and back on again. Yep. There it is. Right there, buddy. I'm right there with you. <laughs> no cat sky. That's right. For Tani, it's no cat sky. Although there are there have been cat-like creatures in this game, not cats per se, but the, I I love the seamlessness. I love it. And, like the only time that it's not fully seamless is when you're warping between systems. And, like, the way they do loading is really, really good. Okay. This is the approximate location. Oh. Gee, I wonder where it could be. It couldn't be the Sentinel Tower here. Nope. Oh, uh, well, I better go ahead and land. Oh, I can't land now that there's... Uh. Oh, you can have a squadron now. So you can recruit uh, random NPCs to your squadron. So they can warp in and fight alongside you when you're doing space battles. There's pirates now, which is great. Normally, nice. I'm, normally I'm for pirates, but, you know, um, being against pirates makes me money. Oh man, where's that stupid... Where's that Sentinel Tower? Where's it at? Where's it at? Where's it at? Ugh. Ugh, now I can't land because they're la they're showing up. And there have been... There have, there have been a little, but like, it's a major focus now. Like, they're everywhere now. There are pirate-controlled systems now. 
So you can go to uh, Outlaw Stations uh, that used to be part of the main network, and now they're controlled by pirates. And you can buy contraband there, which you can bring back to, like, a, um, a legitimate system and sell for big bucks. And then, like, in the pirate systems, the outlaw systems, uh, they have a lot of... Um, a lot of the space battles. Alright, alright, where is this thing? Where is it? Where the hell is it? Oh, come on. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. I'm super over this. Well, at least I can do some of that. And space battles are a little more satisfying because the explosions are bigger and grander now, like this. Kaboom. Look at that big explosion. Bigger, longer, and uncut. <laughs> Thanks, Trey Parker and Matt Stone. How many of them are there left? Three? That's fine. Very Star Fox 64. Yeah. Yeah. Well, can you do a barrel roll? Yes. <clears throat> How many more I got? Just the one? Oh, wait. I need to probably sap this one. Alright, where's this damn thing? I love how I got up to go get something and Bowser's like, ooh! Ooh, we're going somewhere, right? Where are we going? Where are we going? And I'm like, but you're not coming with me. Mm -hmm. Foods. Vivian, what do you have? Do, do, do. Fuck that thing. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no. Fuck you guys. Uh, hey, hey. I fucking love pepperoni pizza. I love pepperoni pizza. Hey. Hey. No one, no one asked you. Big, big bully. Yeah, I know. Where is it coming from? No, that's... Oh, god damn it. Ugh. Ah. gonna die out here. Oh, thank God. Where's my ship? I need to go get back in my ship. I need to run. I need to run. I need to run. Reheated in the air fryer, though. Oh, did you get the crispy crunchity? That sounds delicious. <laughs> yes, that is, that is basically an angry minotaur, is what that is. So we're just going to wait in here for a second. Yes, I know that you see me. I know. Is Melty and Crunchy? Mm -hmm. 
Delish. Alright. Now I run like hell. Fuck your terminal in lockdown. Alright. The pillars are down. How's the terminal? Terminal, are you in lockdown? Shit. Okay. Severance. Okay. Ah. Oh. And now. First, we shut down the Sentinels. Planetary Sentinels disabled. Yeah, you can do that now too, Jonas. Does it disable them for everyone or just you? I think it disables them for everyone on the planet that you're on. I think. But there is a lot to this game. This game is very expansive. There's so many things you can do. I don't need a C-class. And that's it. We're done. Hey, Rusty. What you doing, buddy? You know, sure, Rusty. Whatever you say, little buddy. I love him. And I would murder for him. Alright, let's go collect all of my shit. Some stuff and some things. Ooh, there's one in here. Do, 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 do. You know, I got any more of them, uh... What else we got? We got any more? The cargo drop. That's wheat. Ooh, ooh. Is that the big boys? Yeah, that's the big boys right there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Our chance of failure is practically no. Crypto Bros, too. Okay, but in fairness... In fairness... The computer here knows how it's, everything ends. It's a computer, it's not human, so it's better, you see. Let's go. Oh, I ran out of juice. Well, let's charge her up. Let's go. There we go. All right. Hey, your thermal protection's falling. Just thought I'd let you know. Oh, thanks. I didn't know. I forgot. Eh. Who needs thermal protection? Why does the computer know that? This. Oh. I can't tell you, Jonas, because that would be spoilers. I think I got everything. How far away is that technology? 
That's not far at all. Let's go get it. What are you? What are those? That's condensed carbon. I love condensed carbon. Oh, Rusty, buddy, you can't stand right in front of me while I'm trying to harvest resources. Rusty, we just talked about this little buddy. It's just, oh, it's just floating. Jonas, thanks for stopping by, buddy. It's really good to see you. I miss you bunches. I hope you're doing well. Hey, what, what's up here? Where are you? That's copper. Oh. Oh, that's a big old copper deposit. Hey there, that's buddy. That's what I'm talking about, son. Big old copper deposit. Wouldn't wouldn't condensed carbon just be coal or diamonds? Um, I think it would be closer to coal. Uh, diamonds. I don't think diamond as a concept exists in this game. It's it's closer to coal, I think. But it's also oh, 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 oh. hey. That's an angie plant. There we go. All right, where's my boat? Where did I park my car? This isn't where I parked my car. Oh. What is that? Dioxide? Oh man. I could use some dioxide. Rusty. Rusty, we just talked about this. Rusty, hear ya. Rusty, don't care. <laughs> I feel like Ru Rusty's like a... Rusty's like a dog. He's just like... He's He just wants to be right there, and he's just happy to see you. See, look. He's having such fun. He's He's just having him a good old time. He's just happy to be here. He really is. All right, let's go back to. There's my boat. Little BRB. Okay. I read or listened to John Scalzi's rendition of Little Fuzzy called Fuzzy Nation. Uh, I have not. I have not. I know Scalzi writes some amazing stuff, uh, and I actually follow him on Twitter. But I have not read and or listened to it. I know, Viv. I know. Thunderbase Prime. Let's go. I really want to work on expanding the base. Will Wheaton reads it and did a great job. Nice. I listen to that. Lolly would not be able to listen to it because he would he would not be able to shake the urge to just yell "Shut up, Wesley!" into the uh, into whatever listening device he's currently got it on, even though you know he can't hear him. 
It's okay. I can talk shit about Lolly because he's not here to defend himself. Uh, Alright, so now that it's nightfall and I got a little bit of time on my hands, let's look at something. We got minerals over here, huh? What do we got? shame that I don't have an actual fuck ton oh that's a component of a ferrite I got you babe <laughs> babe there you go bean that's a bean moat for bean he's bean you know hey That's fine. I can make power. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Where's home? Which direction is home? I don't even know, man. Oh, all right, let's see. Oh, I need a metal plating. That's why I didn't put it up. I need... No, not a biofuel reactor. I need a battery. Yep. battery. I need a metal plating. Technology recharge and stuff. Listen, whatever. Generating hey, nothing. I can, I can check Pokemon's IVs in game now. Oh, that's true. You can because you you actually uh, finished the you know the stuff. <laughs> Wait, I got a geode. When did I get a geode? In the geode. Ferrite dust. Hmm. Storage. Hmm. Storage. Storage. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 
Hmm. Sure, what the hell? See, I did it. Okay, now I need to build a supply pipe to go from. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh no, this is fine. This is fine. To a supply grid using pipelines. After increasing capacity, more efficient S siting? Oh, be used. Junction site. Okay. Hey, look, some stuff. That's a boat. Hello there, General, General Kenobi. Kenobi. <laughs> I should probably recharge that too. Forbear, how are you, buddy? <laughs> well done, Viv. Well done. See, it's like the thing Warbear does, but you did it. Uh, all right. Let's see. We're gonna build us one of them there square buildings. Nope, that's not what I meant to do. Right, it goes in the square hole. Everything goes in the square hole, by the way. Yes, that's true. Uh, a straight corridor. Straight corridor. And square room. Straight corridor. Put up a parking lot. It's the very good boy who wants cheese. I love the very good boy who loves cheese. Doing okay, just doing some quick map making, then inside. Nice. Nice. Aww. Buddy, I can see your paw. It's not a very good loaf. He's doing his best. Do it, do it. You both said that at the same time. Elena just looked at me and was like, he's doing his best. He is. Gotta right. tuck it under a little bit, bud. <laughs> Maybe it's an informal loaf. <laughs> an inf <laughs> I have an informal loaf. <laughs> I'm, I like that. Uh, let's see. Now I want to put a... One of them there, hollow doors on this. Yeah, I'm good with that. All right. Oh, I guess I should probably dig this out, huh? He's a very good boy who loves cheese, and yes, you have to say it every time you're talking. Listen, but it's it's important, though, and you know who appreciates that more than anybody, I bet, is Elena. He sure does. Uh, considering that, you know, she's his favorite human. I have also made the executive decision that the, um, the legendaries from Sword and Shield are are the very good boys who who like swords and shields it's true they are i actually um i named mine well actually did i rename the other one i might have uh if i did actually rename both of them because i i do own a copy of sword on cartridge these days i started with shield originally but regardless i did name mine shield doggo and i think sword doggo 
Because, you know, they're shield doggo and sword doggo. It's just who they are. Okay. Now, can I put a mineral extractor in here? Is that possible? Or, I'm sorry, a supply depot. That's what I meant. Can supply depots go... Oh, I have to actually... Sword Doggo and Shield Pupper. I like that. That works. Or Doggo wouldn't get in the fucking ball today. I was pissed. Well, he, listen. He's he's a very independent boy, but he's a good boy. He's doing his best. Yeah, he can also learn how to take a hit, because my Umbreon should not be one-shotting him. Well... Granted, my Umbreon was using his own power against him, but Umbreon should not be one-shotting anything. <laughs> Not unless it grossly overlevels it, and my Umbreon was the same level, so new. No. All right, let's go see how out of alignment it is. Oh yeah, no, that's that's bad. Oh, what's wrong with it? Ain't got no gas in it. <laughs> Man, I'm terrible at this. You know, I should just put this outside. Let's just put it outside. Yeah, you know what? Fine. Fine. Oh, this is good, this is good. Alright, now let's let's build a pipe. And the pipe's gonna go way the fuck out here. Where the hell is the uh that mineral extractor? I don't even know where the fuck it is, to be perfectly honest. I don't even remember. I know it's not this way somewhere. You did a thing today, Viv. What'd you do today? Was it something dangerous and stupid? Because if so, I'm in. I don't care what it is. I'm in. Let's do it. You put in a request for some vacation time. Fuck yeah, that's even better. Although I guess that could also be considered dangerous and stupid depending on what you do on your vacation. I'm very happy for you. Why don't why why are you not happy with this? You tried furiously masturbating. Well, I mean, no. Is that what I'm doing wrong? Yeah, probably. Oh, connection too long. Oh, oh. Let's see what we got here. Extraction rate 222 an hour. Alright, alright. Let's do this. Let's take this. And let's set this to flatten. And let's flatten through here. That the pipeline is unobstructed. Because I want to be able to see it. You might be in talks to set up a trip. Oh, buddy. That would be incredible. I hope you get to take that trip. I really, really do. That would be really good for you. 
Oh no, oh no, didn't mean to do that, nope. Uh, let's see. Break it? No. I couldn't have, right? This is why I don't go to work anymore. Listen. So what? Oh, wait. wait, wait, wait. Okay, there's the pipe. There's the pipeline. It's there. Pipeline is there, right? Oh, okay, okay. So it's it's okay, no, this is good. This is fine. Alright. Um You know that eventually the ground will rebuild itself where you flattened it, right? Yeah, I know. I know. But I want to just make sure. And basically it was just like a visual make sure everything's there. Listen, I can't see the I can't see the supply pipe from here even though like it's there. It's there but it's not. Did you get stuck? I think you got stuck. Is that what's happening right I, now? Yeah, that's that's exactly what's happening right now here. We're, we're, oh, did he get unstuck? Okay. Uh, no, he didn't really get unstuck. Come here, little buddy. There you go. Feel like I should probably turn the AI off, but I'm not gonna. It's kind of fun watching them run around, you know. How are we doing on power? Full. I am three levels deep of battery banks. I goddamn better be full. Oh, I'm gonna do it again, aren't I? Lockhart, tell me not to. Do it, coward. You fucking won't. God damn it. Fuck it, I'm building a service tunnel. Let's go. How low can I go? How low can I go? Secret tunnel. Secret, secret, you got a secret. I am the modern man. Secret, we got a secret. Machine or man again. I've got a secret. <gasps> I've been hiding under my skin. Mm -hmm.
Which is like the... Which is like... Yeah. And now I just dig myself out. I am... I'm not a dwarf, but I'm digging a hole. Oh god, not that not that far, not that far. Oh buddy, get no get out of the hole. There you go. Alright, now There we go. Hi Danielle, how are you? Okay. And now... now that I can check IVs, you know what that means, right? What? Means there is about to be an overpopulation of EVs. Oh no. Is that gray and red? Is that what that is? Okay, I guess it is. It had the best nap and now Steve's hot dogs is on the way. Oh fuck, I love hot dogs. God, I love hot dogs. Oh, that sounds really good. No, this is like red and black. No. Wait. Let's do this. Let's see what this is. It's red and white with the concrete. Oh. Okay. Concrete. Concrete? Funk yeah, concrete. 83% of the world's EV population comes from lollipops game alone. It's true. It's true. That's actually scientifically correct. That's mathematically accurate. All right, now let's just build a bunch of goddamn batteries. Uh, cause we can. Oh, look. Look, it made a bunch of battery spots for me. It's like they knew. Oh yeah, there we go. Look at it storing that sweet, sweet juice. I think I'm going to build one more level of them. Who doesn't need more batteries? Go get those nom noms. Been having a good experience with cloud gaming. I have been. I have been. Um, so I do um, pretty much every Friday. Uh, I will do a a new game um, for you pick. Uh, do I have? Yeah. Um, I've got it on pause right now just because I have a really good backlog, and I'm going to be gone uh, here for a couple weeks, so I don't want to get too too far into a backlog um let's see let's let's back this up a little bit let's let's have a little bit of breathing room so i can work um but yeah uh any chance that i get to to cloud stream i do um and i will play this a lot during the day when i'm like on breaks or at lunch and stuff um i will play on Friday nights, I'm doing this in...
cloud right now. Hi, Rusty. to do it. So now, now I can build a couple more ladders. That's it, right? This is this is everything. I think that's it. I don't think I can build any more ladders. If I can't build another, no. Okay. And now we build more batteries. Every battery. This is my big old battery, my power storage facility here. Did I really build three more layers? I love that I walk outside the Minotaur's like, nothing. <laughs> and Rusty's just Don't hanging worry about out. it. <laughs> right? What a good Rusty. All right. Doing, doing robot things. Doing... You wouldn't understand, because you're not a robot. Oh, well, that's fair. Ooh, good luck, Viv. Viv's going to go try to not let the Warden kill him. I will give you the same blessing that I gave fire the other day. May the warden never hear you coming. That's a Minecraft blessing. I love that Viv posted something in random. It's a couple of like Tumblr posts. The OP is like, so lady is a name and guy is a name. Can you imagine some couple who are just lady and guy? And someone replies and goes like, Lady Dimitrescu and Guy Fieri. And the OP goes exactly like Lady Dimitrescu and Guy Fieri. <laughs> oh God. Oh man. Oh God. 
So let me go check on this because I think I need to give this more resources. Hey buddy, you need more resources? Oh my god, what was... Did you see that? Fine. What the fuck was that? Three aronium. Do I even know? Can I even make aronium? Paraffin. I don't. I don't have any of these things. <laughs> don't worry about it. Famous last words. Jesus Christ, that thing was massive. What she said. There it is. May the warden never hear you coming. Captain Hopper 615. Listen, if you start that Viv, you better... Nice. You better keep a fucking... You better keep a record of those, because I want them all. Alright, view settlement decision. Or status. Alright, alright, alright. We're getting there. Now, let's make a settlement decision. Make policy decision. Okay. Oof. Okay, our research teams are at loggerheads. They've com they have competing proposals. One group insists we will fail without imminently bolstering our anti-sentinel systems. Another insists the time is ripe for improving our habitation systems. Resolution required. Where should we focus our research? Should we research additional facilities, which will remove built on cursed ground and add the, the feature desalination unit? Or should we research farming technology, which will remove built on cursed ground and adds feature caramel ice cream farm? Uh... <laughs> what? Do we add the desalination unit? Do we get rid of the salt in the water? Or do we start farming caramel ice cream? Um... It, 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 it... I mean, we won't really have, like... It doesn't get that granular, Viv... It really just depends on, like, the buff that we get from each one. So we either, like, lower our sentinel stuff. Can you get hydrated from the ice cream? I mean, that's a valid point. There's water in there somewhere. Yeah, but, like, they have drinking water. Like, it doesn't, it doesn't, like, account for stuff like that. And... Really, it's just like a thing that it adds to... Uh, can I back out? Yeah. Alright, so if I go to the settlement status, you see we have like these features here. So like... Sentinel alert level is 33%. Okay. So what's going to happen is, when I make this decision, it's going to remove this built on cursed ground regardless, which will increase citizen happiness. But do we want to reduce the Sentinel alert level, or do we want to raise happiness? Is really what it boils down to, because I think that's what's going to end up happening. They have such a way of expressing that, you see. It's with the it's with the frowny. Do you want a frowny face, or do you want to? Well, I don't know. That's that's what I'm. Fuck it. We're get fuck it. Ice cream for everybody. Caramel ice cream farm decreases maintenance costs. Oh, look at that. So this thing just became more profitable and it's and everybody's happier. Look at that. Caramel ice cream farm. You heard it here first. You heard it here first. Ice cream is the way to go. Uh, 
Is there an unidentified mineral? Oh, right. There's an extreme storm. I should probably go back inside. Are we done? Is that it? Uh, current project will complete in 55 minutes. So just before stream ends. The Overseer is free to explore the universe. Thanks. Uh, Alright, let's go to... Okay. Return to the scientist. Destroy planetary depots. Okay. I don't even remember what this is. Last edited by me almost a year ago. Well, that's that sounds about right. Last edited by me even more almost a year ago. Okay, War Bear. Our these motherfuckers right here. You have... No. No. No, no. Alright. Well. Come back here. Yeah, back here. into a food come up. Oh. Isn't it good though? What is this? Who are you? Wait, what? Wait, what the hell did I get hit for? Tell you what, here's what we're gonna do. Oh god damn it, I don't wanna deal with sentinels. No. No, goodbye. Or, conversely, I could go run away to my freighter. Your hot dog had, wait for it. pork steak, coleslaw, barbecue sauce, and fried onions. Fuck. That sounds really fucking good. That was already my rank. Was it not? <gasps> Hi, Avi. How are you? It's good to see you. Oh, I still need to get in better standing with the Corvax. Yeah, that's about what it sounds like, Danielle. That sounds really fucking good. That reminds me of the time I had a hot dog with pulled pork and coleslaw on it at uh, at Magic Kingdom at Casey's. Oh. Hey, let's see what we got. All right. Ooh, look at this. Sack Venom. A few units, a lot of units. Nitrogen salt, relapsed art crystal, a lot more units, a lot more units. 
Some Gravitino balls. Nice. More units. Activated Indium. More units. And, all right, all right. So let's see what we got here. Okay, okay. Okay, and... And... 1.7 million units. Not bad, not bad. Let's see, how's this one going? Okay. Now that's a visual bug. That's a visual bug. Lolly, look at that ship and what is that ship? That is the SSV Normandy. It sure is, buddy, but that's not, I don't have one of those. That is a visual bug. That's supposed to be a space whale. Request mine merge. The Leviathan. God, see, now now I feel like it's just teasing me. Quinn's dog had crumbled hamburger, cheese, bacon, chopped white onion. It's called the bacon cheeseburger dog. That sounds really good, too. You know what I like? I like a good, like, cheeseburger pizza. A little bit of mustard in there. Not very often, but boy, when I, I get a hankering for it. Uh, what do we got here? Oh, this is a exploration vessel. Uh, let's do a... Yeah, we'll do a balanced one. Boy, this thing is, like, getting, like, really good, like, <coughs> 60 frames a second and everything, cloud streaming. Um, that's fantastic. <laughs> it's all that RAM you've got, you see. It is all that RAM I've got. <laughs> uh, I mean, that is part of it. Like, the video rendering, now, now there's, like, less shared memory. Because, you know, the operating system's always going to... Hey, what is this? I do, oh. I do love the little fragmenting that I'm sure is just No Man's Sky being No Man's Sky. Oh, like the, the artifacting a little bit? The, the, the little black boxes, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. No, that's that's absolutely No Man's Sky. Grateful interloper. Hello, entity. Oh, I think I just took a mission. Oh, hey, look, I got stuff. It does sound really good. Welcome back, Warbear. Welcome home, Marty. King, King of the castle. Hello, hello. Lord of the manor. Hello. Sorry, it's Back to the Future 2 reference. Oh, I still need to hire an Exocraft technician. Do I have one in this, uh... Oh, hey. Those are my refiners. Uh, what's in my exosuit inventory? Oh, not a whole lot. Oh. Am I low on, uh... Can I buy some condensed carbon? Can I just buy some? Hey. I got any of that, uh, condensed carbon? You do not. You got some of them, uh, life support gels, though. I'll buy several of those from you. I love that it's still doing, like, the battle music, because I came inside to go duck out from the, uh... You came inside. <laughs> hey. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. Alright, let's just, uh, let's just warp home. Ooh, I have beaver nuggets.
These are uh, beaver nuggets. They're kind of like corn pops, but more rustic. That was really weird. Okay, now that I'm thinking about it, I know, I don't know if I talked about this recently, but goddamn, all I want is a really good fried pork chop from somewhere around here. And like, it feels like no one around here serves a fried pork chop anymore. Yeah, I was supposed to land in there, and I didn't. Hey, buddy. Oh my god, we have the technology. The what? egg lady actually moves her animate to her animation in real time now. Oh. When the when there when she has an egg, you see so oh, you can yeah. just sit there and do circles in front of her hatching mm -hmm. eggs. Mm -hmm. And she'll she'll do the thing. Yeah, she'll do the th and then eventually she'll like go like this when the egg's ready. Yep. Yep. That's fun, isn't it? It's like, <laughs> Back in my day, you had to reload the zone. It's true. It's true what he says. Is it? Oh, it is raining. It's raining. Anything in here? No. Um. I might... The oxygen harvester has to be outside, doesn't it? Uh, man, I forgot how fast Pokemon do do the deed when uh you're you're dealing with Pokemon from two different generations. Oh yeah, or two, not generations, two, two different, different uh, locations. Regions. Yeah. Yeah. Because I got me one of them Spanish dittos for uh. For shiny increased shiny chances. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You gonna go do a sleep now? Listen, Viv, go digest your your pizzas and get a sleepies. And I love you, and I hope you sleep very oh. well. And have just the best day tomorrow. Because you deserve it. And I love you. Good night, Vivian. Oh, hey, to the surprise of no one, Eevee hatched from the egg. What? Oh? Uh, oh? <laughs> <laughs> I'm pulling five fresh eggs all at one time. I'm going to get five hatches at the exact same time. <laughs> do, 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 do. Do, 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 I also love that they put in the option to just say, hey, don't don't ask me if you want it sent to the box and don't ask me if I want a nickname like those are options yeah because for this that is fantastic yeah just just do it just because I've got those uh those hori joy cons the ones with the back paddles and the turbo button oh so I can just a button through all of the text real fast if I need to, and I've got the back paddles like a like an elite controller. Yeah, you do. Those back paddles are nice. Yeah, they are. 
I'm getting low on carbon. It's not something I thought I'd say. Right, we're just going to let that oxygen harvester do its thing. Hey, let's go over here. Let's see. How is the store supply depot going? Oh, it's going to be a while. Um. Okay, wait. Now I'm concerned. Why? Well, it says there's 222 an hour, and it hasn't started storing any of them yet. So I wonder if there's something wrong with the pipeline because it's too far. Time left in cycle. Oh well, all right. No, it's 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 on the network, so it's fine. All right, that's fine. Can you do like interim storage and like hook up? D do the storage units do pass through? I think they do. Yeah, I because th I think that's why it's like a storage network. So if I were to do two together. It would say that it would have like a 2500 instead of 1250. Yeah, what I'm suggesting is um, you hook one up like in closer the middle. to. Yeah. Yeah. Just so that you have checkpoints to go, okay, it's making it this far, it's making it this far, it's making it this far. So you can kind of see where it's not. Eh, I'll check it later. But it's saying it's filling, so. Yeah, it, like it's it's counting down like it's supposed to, so. How are y'all doing down here? Well, you're starting to store energy. I mean, you're storing. That's that's a lot. Could it be they be using more than they're storing? No, no, because it's there, like, all of them, so it's all connected to a single grid, because the buildings are all connected together, and the batteries are on the, the snap spots in here. So, because the batteries are actually all increasing, they're all increasing, so it's charging, it's generating more power than it's using, which it was anyway. I just have more storage, more power storage in place. Mm -hmm. So, eventually, all of the batteries will fill up again. Okay. Cause like I know they, the goal is just to make sure that you have more storing than what than what you're using. That way, it'll last through the night. I know I know that much, but yeah. And I I, I had that before, like plenty. I just wanted to like, I I honestly just wanted to make like a ridiculous amount of power storage to increase. All right. I think. All right, let's go back. Let's add. We're gonna do a glass roof. Can I do? Can I do a glass tunnel here? I. I mean, it'll let me. Oh, I know why. Cause the freaking I'm I summoned the freighter out. There we go. Now I can. Not the viewing sphere, the glass tunnel. Crystal soul. Observe the viewing globe. Heh. <laughs> uh, Radiation protection. Is that a cons that's not a consumable, is it? 
Uh, I need a crystal sulfide. Can I not make crystal sulfide? Do I have to like, get crystal sulfide? Liquid explosive. I'm not seeing it. Hmm. No, I, I can't just make more crystal sulfide. Not like this anyway. Alright, let's do this. Let's go back indoors for a minute. I'm not standing out in the radiation. Let's, let me go see if crystal sulfide is something that I can refine. Crystal sulfide. Can be obtained from the sides of underwater vents. Oh, that's it. Okay. Oh, wait, no. No, oh. I can also get sodium nitrate out of it, but I can't make it. Well, I guess that makes sense, because it's an underwater thing, and they want you to use the glass stuff for underwater stuff, so... Alright, fine. Well, then we won't do that. Let's come out here. Uh... Dome. All right. Now, what do I need to build? I need to. Let's see. I need to construct a hydroponics tray. Okay. All right. Oh, I need metal plating. Metal plating. Okay. Wednesday, my dude. It is Wednesday, my dude. Evie hash from the egg. Nice. I never expected that. It's impossible. Oh, hey, I did it. Okay. Cool. 
No, I don't want to do that. Approximate growing time four hours. Ugh. Oh, I get it. I don't have to have. I don't have to have a hydroponics tray because I built a biodome, which has its own hydroponics built in. Thus, the little water majig that's down there. Oh, I need more cactus flesh. Dang. Well, that's that then. Unless there's more cactus flesh on the uh, the old market there. You don't got any cactus flesh? I'm not seeing any cactus flesh. Unless I missed it. No. Okay. Oh, hey, how am I on ion batteries? Uh, 145 is fine. Can I put a glass roof on on this? Or can I put a biodome above it? Mm, I don't think it'll do that. No. Let's see. No, I can't just put a. I can't just put a, a roof on it. Ah, well, it is what it is. Uh, let's go. All right, grow and harvest gut rot flowers, which I'm working on. Bring the scientist's core to a monolith. Stations. Oh my god, Power Wash Simulator is already heading to 1.0. Wow. They've been working on it really hard, though. Hmm. Sorry. That was, that was loud. July 14th. Nice. That's exciting. Hey, Bean. Power Wash Simulator is going to be released on, like, fully released on July 14th. It's done. Yep. I was going to wait for my deck to play that, but maybe I won't. And maybe you won't. Rusted Metal. I love Rusted Metal. All right. Space Station Scrap Dealer. Blah, blah, blah. Bring scientists' core to a monolith. Right, reconnect the science scientist to the convergence. All right, where are we going? Where are we going? We're going over here. Ah, hello. Arrive in one week. Hmm, I don't think so. Ah, I like I like twenty seconds. Look at it go. Look at it go. That's a noom. But I tell you, this whole, like game streaming thing is just really good. Like they're they're really good at this. And I use the hell out of it, probably more than I should. But you know, there's no restrictions on game time or whatever. Task manager just did task? Is Task Manager updatable through the store? Ooh, oops. I got I got distracted because Task Manager. That dark mode on Task Manager is fantastic. Isn't it gorgeous? The new like the the new Task Manager that's coming out in the next several weeks uh, on Windows 11. They rewrote it. Um, the the visual part of it. 
It's going to be, it's got a dark mode. Uh, the tabs that were along the top are now along the side with icons. Um, it's just, it's really nice. Like, just really, really nice. Hey, this looks like one of those Atlas monoliths. Hey, look, I found it. All on my own. Oh, look, knowledge. No stones. one was looking. I was thinking of you. Oh, this is. Oh, this yeah, did I mention? I was all by myself. I was all by myself. I'm actually not by myself. Because I have a. I have I have two AI consciousnesses with me. I got Rusty and I'm holding on to the the scientist. You make your base public by any chance? Are you like can people come visit you? Uh I can, yeah. <laughs> That's what that last one says is error. It's like when the, it's, like, it's like when the dog goes. Very similitude failure. Emotional breakdown. What? Monolith off. I, I, I broke the monolith. Oh, use the space station teleport to quickly return. Well, see, here's the thing, though. He's not on my base. Yeah, it's right there. So, yeah, I can... Network, uh, so it's enabled. Uh, if anyone comes to my planet, because I like it was, it was. I think everybody spawns on their own individual planet. Um, so if you come visit me, if you play multiplayer with me, you can like register my base as a destination. Because, like, you can, if you warp to or from it. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Not this again. Ugh. Hey, look. It's doing that bug out thing where it doesn't render my... God, I hope I can actually get out of my ship. Alright, it looks like I'll be able to. Who the fuck are you? You got anything good? Offer to trade. Well, I just want... I just want some freaking carbon, man. Just somebody, somebody sell me some carbon. That's all I want. I just want to buy carbon. I am, I am flush with cash. I have 75 million credits. I just want to buy some goddamn carbon. Uh, I don't want chlorine and copper. I mean the copper. I do nice. like that, uh... I do like that this game kind of just did away with all pretense that the leveling aspect of a nursery of of the breeder was the daycare was what we were in what we were wanting. Yeah. What we used it for. I'm like they know. They know. We're shiny hunting. We're either shiny and or EV hunting. That's it. Or IV hunting. Or K.
honestly, the only thing that's really slowing me down at the moment is the fact that I keep getting, like, when you go through this hoopla, you end up with, because the Destiny Knot rolls ten of the, or re, re, like rolls five of the or the five of the ten IVs between everybody or however many, it re-rolls a whole bunch of the IVs onto the onto the Pokemon, so they get a mishmash of all of the um, perfect IVs. So each generation has a good chance of having more perfect IVs. So you you keep having to swap EVs out, and that's literally the part of this that's taking forever. Otherwise, I'm just doing circles and grabbing an egg anytime I see her do her thing. It's pretty fun. Nice. Actually, way faster than it used to be. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> when I care for the blueprint, well, well, sure. Hey, I did it. Noise. All right. I got to go do destroy some depots. But not home depots. Space station. Uh, potential technic technician recruit. Oh, okay. Let's just go out. Let's go outside. Nice. <laughs> no fucking luck, heart. <laughs> Listen, I can. I can change it. I can update it. All right. <laughs> get out for if I just have to go back to my home system. I'm just gonna go back home. Yeah, I'm just going to warp. I mean, I'm just going to teleport. I'm not going to warp. Why why use warp cells when I can just teleport? Space stations. Oh, look, an Eevee hatched from the egg. What? I'm shocked. Shocked. Well, not that shocked. <laughs> All right, locate a Sentinel Depot. Okay. I love blowing up Sentinels. Oh, and it's on a home planet? Hell yeah. This Hell is my yeah. home planet. Hell yeah. I love, I love that it's like this depot is directly below the space station. 
like the space station's up there, right up there somewhere. I love when you're good about it and like some of these planets can in space stations and stuff can be close enough that when you're on the ground they'll render in the sky. Yeah. Or like when you're if your freighter's nearby, it'll actually render out in the sky. Mm -hmm. or like they, look, look there's there's a perfect example of what you were just saying. There's a couple of planets right there or like a planet and a moon. Just rendered right there. Alright. Let's save this. God, I have so much navigation data that I don't need. Uh Well, I'm fully healed. Boy, I'm about to... Oh, I should probably finish that. Yeah, Corvax casing. Well... Let's piss off the Sentinel. You want to piss off the Sentinel? Do it, coward. Alright, fuck it. Oh man, there's so many of them now. <laughs> All right. Where's my boat? Let's go. Oh, I'm already alert level three. No one cares. I'm just going to keep going. What's the worst that could happen? Oh, I, I'm out of range now. Boom. And now we just whoosh right into that space station. Yeah. Oh, I don't need to go to the space station. Nope, I don't need to go to the space station. You know where I need to go? Let's do this. Let's... No, actually, I am going to go to the space station because what I want to do is... I'm going to go home. I'm going to teleport home. And I'm going to call up my freighter from home. And then I can go to it. I am, it it does bug me the tiniest bit that I can't teleport to my freighter. I know why. I get it. It is a technical challenge to be able to do that. Cuz the freighter is not in a stationary position. The freighter moves unlike other teleporters. Still, it makes me a little sad, and I wish I could do it. Boy, I keep hearing boom booms outside. Do you? Mm, not off the top of my head, no. Hmm. I've also got several things going on, so. That's fair. See, there's a thing in the sky. There's one out there. There's probably more out here. If I look around enough. Up, oh, there's one. That's a thing. Now what we're going to do is... Country roads or whatever. 
And now we lift off. And now we go. And we whoosh. And there's my freighter. In low... Low Earth orbit. Oh, that's a big one. I'm glad it's raining, though. Bean's head was really hurting this morning. Like, sinusy. But she doesn't get those very often anymore since she had her surgery last year, but... Mm -hmm. So when it when she gets Oh, them, yeah, I just heard a boom. Oh, uh, did you? All right. Let's go talk to the old armor. Scatter blaster module. Okay. Collect Viking oh. daggers. How many do I need? It's like I probably got some. Do I have any? No, not there. Here be. Okay. No. Uh, no. Well, let's just go buy some. Oh, I got more. I got more salvage glass. Ooh. Can I just throw that in? Yeah, I can just do that there. Neat. If there's any in the market. Dang. In there. More to acquire Viking daggers. Taking traders at outposts or find them in planetary containers. Oh. Well, then I need to go find an outpost. Alright. Outpost it is. Uh, let's go down to. Let's boot back downstairs. I think that's just what I'm going to say now. We're going upstairs. We're going downstairs. I had to go be the bug slayer. Oh, yeah. What was it? A uh, moth. Oh. Could be worse. Could be worse. Come here, buddy. Uh, yeah. Alright, I need you to find me an outpost. And you already have. See, this is... You're, you're very good. I, know, I gotta come up with, with a name for the Minotaur. Like, don't get me wrong. Minotaur's a great name as it is. But I need... I need to give him a name. I have an idea. I'm listening. Now, just just hear me out here, all right? Okay. Irregardless. Stop that. I got a shiny Eevee. Oh my god, did you? I just got a shiny Eevee. Here, look, just for you, buddy. Just for you, I got you. Oh man. That's the good one. That's like like there's only one there's only one that's more like dramatically good than that. And so, yeah. you know, well done. Oh my god, the fact that I got a shiny already is That's pretty sweet. Unbelievable. 
You got that. You got your shiny charm too, don't you? Yeah. Well, there you go. See, you got that Masuda. No, 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 no. I don't. Oh, you I don't? don't? Oh. Nope. That's even more no, it's impressive. Just the, like one in, it's the one in 600 something. Oh. Because with the shiny charm and the Masuda, it's 512, I think. Yeah. Graw. This baby. Let's practice my, uh, practice my language skills. Bless. Hey, look, I got a dagger. The Viking like me. Although I started with, you know, with their system, so. Grade pulse splitter module. I'll fucking take it. Pirate. I know that. I now know the Viking word for pirate. It's not just yar. No, that's the pirate word for pirate. I got another dagger. All right, I did it. I got two daggers. All right, let's go back to the old who's he busting majig. Yeah. All right, and away we go. Oh, it's right there. Hey, remember the time it was right there? Right there. Right there. Love being able to do that. Having enough jetpack juice to just whoosh up there. <gasps> CKY. What are stairs? What are stairs? Stairs, stairs are a thin man's game. 
TKY, how are you, buddy? What's going on tonight? No, you know, playing some No Man's Sky, just kind of chilling out tonight. You just woke up? Nice. Uh? Settlement productivity has increased. Alright. Okay. Oh. Did you know that the Viking word for gra is gra? That's pretty good. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right, now I'm gonna do a couple of things. Let's make sure. Let's see how our okay, all of our uh... look. It's still taunting me. It's still taunting me. And this is where you could have your Normandy. If you weren't such a if you chunk. had one. Yeah. Yeah. This is this is my own fault for not doing that expedition. I, I, I could have done the expedition, but I didn't. And now I don't have a Normandy. And I am really sad. They could have done a makeup one for, you know, Legendary Edition coming out, but that's understandable. I get it. I had my chance. I'm just a little sad about it. They, they did a rerun of it. Of the expedition? Yeah. You missed it twice, I guess. God damn it. Uh, See, they did a rerun of it around the time Legendary Edition came out. Well, now I feel even... Now I feel even dumber. View citizen request. So much honor the passing of a rare comet, though such an event would not be without cost. Polling indicates a 93% approval rating. Now what the hell? Why not? Alright, we got some debt, but I'm not worried about that. Like our current debt is... Oh, that's fine. Can you just pay that debt? Uh, you can't pay the debt. No, the settlement has to pay its own debt. You're just the overseer. I would if I could. Look at 69, Instead, It's 000. like a drop in the bucket. Yeah, it is. Also like, nice. Yeah, it'll take, it'll take me a few hours to do it. And then it'll be fine. But my citizen happiness went up. So I'm not worried about it. Engage and destroy sentinels. Sentinels. Come here. I'm not done with you. Come here, you little shit. Yeah. Where are you?
I need to head back into a building for a second and recharge my. Can I? I can't grab that from there. Perfect. Who wants some? Who wants some? You want some? fix your buddies. I love that I love that the Sentinels basically have tanks and healers now. Just pick up all these combat supplies that are on the ground. Isn't there more of them around? I thought there was. Nice. Ooh. That's purple. It is. There's one. Yeah, get the fuck out of my town. Is there any more? Oh, there's some over here. Let's go grab these. Oh, right, right, these two. I think that's it. Alright, let's go back inside. Let's see how everybody's doing in here. Settlement status. Alright. Oh, yeah, that debt will be paid off by morning. Now, I can go over here. Check on this. Oh, look at that. That's cool. I got a little I got another little dock. Neat. So other people can come and hang out. Cool. Alright. That's that. I've done that. See what I get out of this. Oh, all right, all right, not bad. All right, let's go back to my armor. Oh wait, my armor is back in the other system. Uh, hold on, let me do this. Let me land. This will be the last thing I do tonight. Let's go. I'm in the freighter. You go up yonder. Talk to our armor river river river.
now that I have engaged the Sentinels in a glorious battle. Very... yeah. How very Klingon of you. Oh yeah, so very much. I mean, look at him. He's he's kind of got like ridges on his forehead, or like the one. Well, well, well. Hi, Pernt. How are you? What you up to tonight? Grah, 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 grah. Yeah, they're they're basically they're basically the Klingons. Uh, let me. That's it. That's all for that. So. I'm doing great, but it's time for me to be done. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I'm doing that. Wait, what? Okay, listen. I just gotta go see what this one last thing is. I just gotta go see what this one last thing is. There's a saloon. But you did the thing. I did do the thing. I did do the thing, but I gotta go see this one last thing. Well, I'm glad you got to come by too, Pern. I'm very happy to see you. Paint's wonderful. I've I've met her through a couple of different streams. Uh, mostly all kind of uh, stemming from Tugboat's community. Tug's cool. He's he he's an okay guy. And he's doing his own text -to speech now. He is doing his own text -to speech now, which is hilarious. I heard Tom has uh has plans to make him say the word moist as many times as the chat will allow him to say yeah. it. <laughs> Absolutely yes. Absolutely yes. Alright, there's a there's a saloon. Where is the saloon? I have to go to this. <laughs> Come on, Paint. I'm best friends with Tom. You know this is the kind of shit etiquette that we get down around this, around these parts. Oh my God, we're building a saloon. All right. Well, that's that. Uh, let me run back inside so I'm not just standing in the heat, and potentially an extreme heat storm when I spawn back in later. <laughs> you are offended. Listen, you sh you probably should be, honestly. <laughs> and I am not sorry. Alright, let's head back to the... Let's head back home, go save, and then get the heck out of here. <laughs> Listen, I'm one thing, if nothing else, and that is on brand. What can I tell you? <gasps> Is there a loaf? Loaferino! Seriously, why does it sometimes just bump me outside? Round the outside, round the outside. Hey buddy, what you doing? Just hanging out? Yeah, you're just hanging out. And that is that. All right. That is how the crumble cookies. That's all that. I still gotta hire an exocraft technician. Uh, I gotta search the base computer. It has archives like this. And yeah. And I'll eventually go. Find that and do it. Okay. Let's get the heck out of here. And where's the where's the quit button?
There we go. Okay. All right. I'm done. I'm done. Um, QWERTY layout is still poop. And 10 out of 10. Don't like it. Yeah. Well, QWERTY's trash. Computers were a mistake. And I know computers came after the QWERTY layout, but point is, it's all still a mistake. Um, all right. Let's see. This Friday, I still have no idea what I'm doing. I have no idea. <gasps> Hi, Karen. Bye, Karen. I love you, too. Um, I still don't know what I'm doing this Friday. I may play more of this. I don't know. I may just keep playing this because I'm really enjoying it. Sorry, CK Way. I gotta go. I gotta go do the kitty cuddles and go to bed and stuff. Um, yeah. So I might do more of this on Friday. Sunday's retro night. I will know by Friday what game I'm playing for Retro Night on Sunday. Monday I'll be on 14, and next Wednesday is one more group therapy, and I might. Two Point Radio? Maybe. Maybe Two Point Radio on Friday. I don't know yet. Maybe. Um, I don't know. I haven't... I've been I've been in a super chill mood lately, so like No Man's Sky has been really super chill for me. Okay, I gotta get out of here. Um, let's figure out who to raid. Oh, I just... we haven't gone to see Lissa in a minute, and let's go see Lissa. Uh. Let's go see Lissa. Okay. I well, I love you, Karen. All right. Let's go. We're going to go see Lissa. Give her lots of love. Be good to her. Be nicer to her than you would be to me. Uh, m that mostly goes for you. No. Fair enough. All right. Um, <laughs> fine. Well, then to hell with all of you then. Um, all right. Thank you all again for being here. Hey, remember, be good to yourselves, be good to each other, and get out of my office. <laughs>